Hi guys, it's Jamie. I'm just gonna do a really quick workout for any of my friends. Um, a lot of my seniors and any of my friends that might be rehabbing an injury or maybe you can't work out cardio hardcore. This is part of the Enhanced Fitness Program, which is for arthritis, um, good for my friends with Parkinson's, um, osteoporosis, right? I'm gonna give you four arm moves that you can do standing or completely sitting in the chair. So if you're in your chair, maybe turn on some music. I'm not gonna use any so you can hear me. Sitting up nice and tall in your chair. Our back is not rounded, right, like this. We're up nice and tall, and we engage that core and just kinda zip it up through the middle, right? And then we're gonna um, go through the forearm movements. I'm gonna do them all with you. So go ahead, pause this if you need to, grab your chair, turn on your favorite music, and we're gonna go through these four quick arm movements that help build bone and muscle strength. All right, here we go. Grab your chair. Come on, let's go sit. All right. So you can do these standing, right? And if you're standing, I want you to make sure your booty's not sticking out. I want you to kind of bend the knees softly just a little bit, and then we tuck it under and you pull your core in, your abs come in. All right, if you're sitting, we sit up nice and tall. My feet are flat on the floor. Let me see if I can show you my feet. This is gonna be impossible here. All right, so my feet are flat on the floor, right? They're not crossed. Sometimes you guys like to cross them. Let me see if I can do it like this. Flat on the floor, okay? Here we go. Get those weights, they don't have to be weights. You can do it with nothing at all, or you can do it with a water bottle, which I think weighs like one or two pounds, or you can grab your favorite weights. Okay, we do one arm at a time, so I'm gonna sit up nice and tall. My shoulders are not here. I'm gonna relax my shoulders, here we go. 10, notice how I'm stopping at my shoulders, right? I'm not going higher than my shoulder. I'm not swinging. I'm going up at the same speed as I'm coming down. So this is four, good. My arm is right next to my body. Three, my elbow is nice and straight. Nothing is bent. Two, and one. We'll do rounds of eight here. You can do 10 if you want. And we're gonna extend that right arm down by our side. Here's 10. I'm gonna turn to the side. You stay right where you are. I wanna show you how my elbow is not bending here. Here we go. Eight. I think you're on six. Here's five. And down. And four. Notice I'm stopping at my shoulder. And down. Keep going. No bend in that elbow. Three. And down. Here's two and down, and one, and down. Rest that right arm on the leg. Left arm comes down by your side. We're gonna pretend we have glue or peanut butter and we're gonna stick it down. The peanut butter to the jelly or the glue to the body. So our elbow never lifts for our bicep curls. This is your bicep right here. That strong muscle you have, that is your bicep, right? So what we're gonna do, Bring that arm down, relax the shoulders, feet are flat on the floor, elbows glued. We curl up and watch at the bottom how I turn that weight. Good, and as we come up, the hand turns towards the shoulder. Two, and down, and three, and down. We're going to eight, four, and down, five. Keep breathing, and down. Make sure you drink your water, six, and down, here's seven, and down, one more, eight, and down, switching sides, left hand down, right arm by your side, here we go, elbows glued, 10, oh, we're doing eight, so I'm all mixed up, here's seven, good, keep going, and six, my elbow never leaves my side, five, good, here's four, Yes, and three, keep going. Show me those muscles. Two, one more, and one. Beautiful, those are your first two. Now we're gonna pick up our purse, or our toolbox, or our Publix bag, or even start our lawn mower. So I'm gonna show you from the side. You stay right where you are. I'm gonna come to the side. 
right? And I'm just gonna lean forward just a little, not rounding forward, right? I'm nice and tall and I just hinge a little. I'm gonna reach for my lawnmower. I'm not gonna look at you because then my neck gets all turned and all mixed up. And I just wanna keep everything nice and aligned. So I'm gonna reach for my lawnmower. I'm gonna pull straight back and I'm gonna press straight down and out a little. So I pull back and down. I want to show you from the front because so many times I see my students going out to the side, right? We don't want to do that. We want to, we want to pretend like it's right brushing the side of the ribs. So we go straight back and we push out again, straight back and press. Here's six and press and five. I'm sorry I'm not looking out at you. I'm looking out at the floor past my feet so I can keep my neck and my spine aligned. I don't know how many we have. Maybe three more. Three and press and two and press and one and press. Rest that left hand down, bringing the weight into the right arm. And here we go. Pull that lawnmower chain and release. Pick up that purse. Good. Maybe you're dreaming of shopping these days since we haven't been out. Maybe you're dreaming of the mall. Where did you go shopping today? I want you to picture it. I want you to pick that bag up and I want you like someone's gonna grab it and you say, nope, it's mine, right? Watch that elbow straight back against your body. Don't let it leave your body. Three more maybe, three and press. Here's two and press. Here's one and press. Good. If that hurts your back at any time, sometimes I let my students just put their weights down and we just grab the drawer and we pull the drawer back and we push the drawer, right? We open it and we close it. We open the drawer and close it, which leads me to our last and final arm, a tricep kickback. I'm gonna show you where the tricep muscle is. And so right here in your arm, it's gonna come right here. Watch when I push back. Oh gosh, I don't have a big one, but you see a little line right there? Can you see it right there? Yeah? All right, that is your tricep right back here. It's in the opposite place of your bicep. So your bicep is in the front, your tricep is in the back. We always wanna work both things. So if you work out your belly, you gotta work out your tummy. If you work out your quads, you gotta work out your hamstrings. And so if you work out your biceps, we wanna get the triceps. We wanna stay balanced in life, right? So here's our last one, our tricep kickback. Remember, I'm gonna put my weight down. Remember that lawnmower we just did? Well, when you get to the top of it, I want you to freeze, all right? I'm gonna to go to the side and show you guys. So, we pulled our lawnmower back and I'm gonna hold it here. From my shoulder to my elbow is not gonna move, right? It's frozen. I'm just gonna kick back and bring it in. Good, kick back and bring it in. And kick. Let's do that together. All right. So pull that lawnmower up. Hold it at the top. Not out here. Close that elbow. Close. It's not a chicken wing. Hey, right? bring it back. Here we go. Ten and in and seven. We're doing eights and in and six and in and five and in and four. I'm looking out down at the floor past my toes. Three. Bring it in. nice and controlled. Just as slow back as you bring it in. Two and one and switch sides, switch arms. Good. Let's pull that lawnmower back. Tricep kickbacks. Here we go. Eight and in. I got the count right. Seven and in. Here's six and in and five and in. Here's four and in and three, and in, and two, you got it. You can do one more of anything, here we go. And one, and in, set it down nice and safe on the floor. Good, you guys, take a big stretch. Let's just open those arms. I'm actually out of breath. Watch as my hands flex back. You see, I'm opening my chest, right? And I'm pulling back. Good, and we're gonna do some fist flings. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pull in and out and in 
and open and stretch and in and open and stretch in and open and stretch in and open and stretch good shake it out shake it out take a big breath maybe get yourself some water i'm gonna get a sip of water oh my gosh keep that water close it's hot out i took a walk with my girls i have twin girls we're gonna wrap this up really quick with some arm stretches and this will be your arm workout you can go through you can rewind it back and you can do it two times if you want super fun times huh all right, it's good, you guys. Remember, you don't have to use the weight at all. Bringing that left arm across your body. You can hold it here. You can maybe press it here. Sometimes you can even give yourself a hug, a pat on the back. Yes, good. And some deep breaths in. Whew. Open wide like I showed you. Flex those hands back and switch. This time your right arm comes across. Maybe you either want to open and close the hand. You can hug yourself. You can hold it here. This is your body, so you do what feels good for you. All right. Ooh, it's hot in here. I'm in my garage. Woo. But I'm glad because there's no kids here. They're all inside with my husband, so I'm going to enjoy my time with you. Left arm comes up and over like you're patting yourself on the back. You can push from the front. If you feel super flexible, I want you to notice my chin doesn't move, right? So my chin doesn't drop down because I'm trying to reach. So you can reach over like this, or you could just gently push from the front and release it down. Right arm comes up. Give yourself a pat on the back. You can press from the front or you can reach it over. Good. Give myself a pat on the back. You deserve it. Give yourself a pat on the back. My daughter French braided my hair today. I'm so grateful. Ah, and relax. Can you shake it out? I want you to take a big breath. Inhaling up. Exhale, pressing down and away. Let's play the piano. Let's keep those fingers nice and loose. Play the piano. Good, oh my goodness, my wrists. I've been on my phone so much lately. Maybe you've been on your computer or clicking on that TV remote, right? And so those muscles get sore. I'm gonna get a little closer so I can see your beautiful face, right? And so we're just gonna turn, reverse the wrist circles. Good, you guys. You make your own rules, right? So set your goals. Let's just open and close. Good. Now we're going to touch pinky to thumb. Da, 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 da. Try to smile while you're doing it. Can you smile? Yes, yes, yes. I miss you guys so much. How fast can you go? One of my students, Nordy, always does this so fast because he used to play bassoon or I don't even know what he said he played. Something with his fingers. I'm not even sure what a bassoon plays with. I think that's an instrument though. Good. All right, open and close up. Can you open your jar? You can stay there. Keep opening your jar. Keep opening your jar. Maybe you have a little ball around your house. Um, my friend um, Barb from Fitness 320 lent this to me this week. So we can turn the ball or you could just do an imaginary ball. Maybe, keep going. Reverse your circle, close your jar. So you are opening your jar. You could even use a little tennis ball. I have um, some of my students that get their pill bottles. I'm just turning your pill bottles. Good, let's do it the other way. We're gonna open, keep going. I like the bigger one. Open, good, and we're gonna close. Good, just working those fingers. And you can come here, right? And I'm just gonna hold it chest tight, right? And I'm just gonna press and release. Can you add the breath? Inhale, exhale, press. Inhale, open. Exhale, press. You might not even need a ball. And open. Exhale, press into each other. And relax. One more. Press. Good. And relax. Can you bring your arms like a football goal post? I'm going to back up a little so you can see me. So I'm going to bring my arms. You can stay in your chair. Good. And I'm just going to close. Can you get your elbows and your hands together? And open. Good, close and open. When I close, I'm pressing into each other. I feel a little bit of a shake, a little bit of resistance. And open, good, and close. Two more, we're gonna do five. Inhale as you open, 
exhale, close. Now high and wide. Inhale, open. Exhale, can you close? Good. And send it up. And relax. Good. You're probably still seated, seated in your chair, right? And so let's just gently reach back. Good. Notice I'm going to turn my body with my hand. I'm going to keep my eyes on my hand, so I'm not just going back like this, right? So a few there to gently twist the back. And then maybe some shoulder rolls. Yeah, these are just some ideas. You can go back and do them again yourself. And reverse, wanna add those elbows. I love to add my elbows to my shoulder rolls. Okay, one more, reverse. Oh, I'm not cueing your breathing. You better keep breathing in and out. Breathing is good for you. Good, you guys. And rest, let's take a gentle stretch. Can you bring your hands over, cross your left arm over your right? And can you press your palms together? Good, feel that stretch in the shoulder. Sometimes I like to stand up if you want, and I like to just go a little bit side to side. Yes, good. All right, what we do on one side, we have to do on the other. So bring it over. Now my right hand is over my left. All right, you can hold it here. Good, or you could stand up and just rock side to side. Whew, good. Oh my goodness, relax. Oh, my shoulders. You might be feeling it. I'm feeling it. I haven't seen you guys in almost two weeks. I'm feeling it. Get yourself some water. We're almost done. Good. We're going to work on our neck just a little bit. Let's stretch that neck out. So sitting up nice and tall. Good. Once again, fixing your clothes if you need to. We're going to look to the left. And center. Exhale, look over the right shoulder. And center. Oh, I need to relax my shoulders. And side. Exhale, center. Inhale, big. And look over your shoulder. Good. And this is one that feels really silly. We're going to kiss each other. So we're going to kiss. Now show me your double chin. Back. And kiss. And back. So, double chin. Remember that movie, My Big Fat Greek Wedding? Keep going. My bandana's falling off. Do you remember that movie when they all pulled each other's, they held on and pulled each other's faces back so that they got their face lift, right? Good. So I like to call those kisses. Good. All right, now one more gentle stretch in that neck. We're gonna bring our left hand over and drop your ear to your shoulder. I'm not pressing hard at all, just a little bit. Now you can extend this arm. My shoulder's not here, it's down. I'm gonna flex my hand back, pulling those fingers up and back, and just relax. You'll feel that stretch in the neck. Inhaling up. Exhale, switch sides. My fingers are pulled up and back. You're doing so good. I'm so proud of you for taking time for yourself and for your body. And bring it center and release. Big breath, inhaling up, exhaling, pressing away. Good, you guys. I feel like I wanted to do one more thing with you. Oh no, it's escaping my mind. But let's just take a few more breaths. Maybe it'll come to me. Inhaling up, exhale, press away. Wobbling my fingers, it's spread wide. I'm reaching for the walls. Good, inhaling up. Pressing away. Can you give me two more? Uh oh, here comes my kids. This is my cue. I'm right here, baby. Inhale up. Exhale. You want to come say hi? Quick, quick, quick. I'm almost done. Inhale up. Hello. Exhale down. Come here. Tell everybody be safe. Be safe. Work out a little bit. Work out a little say, bit. Say, keep on moving. Keep on moving. Say, we love you. We love you. And we'll see you soon. Can we blow a kiss on the count of three? One, two, three.